Uptative presents five surprising psychology facts that reveal the hidden depths of the human mind. Number one. Our emotions can influence the way we perceive the world around us, leading to a phenomenon called emotional contagion. Emotional contagion is a fascinating phenomenon in psychology that highlights how our emotions can have a powerful influence on those around us. Essentially, emotional contagion refers to the process by which people catch the emotions of those around them, either consciously or unconsciously, and begin to experience similar emotional states themselves. This can happen through a variety of channels, including facial expressions, tone of voice, and body language. For example, if you are in a room with someone who is anxious, you may begin to feel anxious yourself, even if you were feeling calm before. Similarly, if you are around someone who is happy and excited, you may find yourself feeling more positive and energized as a result. Emotional contagion can be a powerful force for good or bad, depending on the emotions being transmitted, and is an important area of study in the field of social psychology. Number 2. The mere act of smiling can actually make you feel happier, due to the feedback loop between our facial expressions and emotions. It's true that the act of smiling can actually have a positive impact on our emotional state. This is because our facial expressions and emotions are closely linked in what's known as a feedback loop. When we smile, the brain receives signals from the muscles in our face that are associated with happiness and pleasure. These signals can actually trigger the release of certain neurotransmitters in the brain, such as dopamine and serotonin, which are associated with feelings of happiness and well-being. Research has shown that even faking a smile or putting on a fake-it-till-you-make-it attitude can have a positive effect on mood and reduce stress levels. So the next time you're feeling down, try putting on a smile, even if it feels forced at first. It just might help to improve your mood and make you feel a bit happier. Number 3. The unconscious mind plays a much larger role in our decision-making than we often realize, with research suggesting that up to 95% of our decisions are made unconsciously. It's true that the unconscious mind can have a significant impact on our decision-making processes. Despite our belief that we are in control of our thoughts and actions, research suggests that up to 95% of our decisions are made unconsciously. Our unconscious mind is constantly processing information and making snap judgments based on our past experiences, emotions, and beliefs. This can happen without us even realizing it, and can influence our behavior in ways that we are not aware of. For example, we may feel drawn to a certain person or product without being able to explain why, or make decisions based on subtle cues that we may not consciously register. Understanding the role of the unconscious mind in decision-making can be important in a variety of contexts, from marketing and advertising to personal growth and development. By becoming more aware of the ways in which our unconscious mind shapes our behavior, we can work to make more intentional and informed decisions, and better understand the motivations behind our actions. Number 4. The bystander effect refers to the tendency for people to be less likely to help someone in distress when others are around, due to diffusion of responsibility. The bystander effect is a well-known social phenomenon that describes how people are less likely to offer help or intervene in an emergency situation when other people are present. This is often due to the diffusion of responsibility, where individuals assume that someone else will take action, leading to a lack of action by anyone in the group. This effect has been observed in a wide range of settings, including urban areas, workplaces, and online communities. Awareness of the bystander effect can help individuals be more aware of their own behavior and take action to help others in need, even when others are present. Number 5. Our brains are wired to respond more strongly to negative experiences than positive ones, which is known as the negativity bias. The negativity bias is a cognitive phenomenon that refers to the tendency of the human brain to respond more strongly to negative experiences than to positive ones. 
This means that negative events, emotions, or experiences tend to have a stronger impact on our thoughts, feelings, and behavior than positive ones. This bias has evolved over time as a survival mechanism to help us detect and respond to threats or danger in our environment. However, in modern times, this bias can also lead to negative thinking patterns, anxiety, and stress. Understanding the negativity bias can help individuals develop strategies to overcome it and focus more on positive experiences and emotions. If you like this video hit the subscribe button, share it with your friends so we could make some more. Until next time.